guys, this is the first workout back after the Iron Man. I am an Iron Man, and I will not share with you my time for the Iron Man race. Because it doesn't matter, because I finished, and I'm, I'm an Iron Man. Okay, so today we're going to do, we're jumping right back into it, and uh, I'm actually dreading it a little bit because it's the first one back, and the Iron Man was a week ago yesterday, or a week ago Sunday. So, 20 minute hit. We're doing five sets of four minutes, okay? And each four minute set will be 30 seconds, 30 seconds, no rest, back and forth for four minutes. If it's only one exercise, there's a right and a left side, and then the two exercises, we flip back and forth every 30 seconds. So, we're gonna go, and every time the four minutes completes, you'll hear activity completed. And then you just get a sip of water, shake it off a second, and then start your next set, okay? So it'll be 20 minutes with however much rest in between each four minute set that you decide to take. Okay, and we'll see how much rest I have to take. So, all right, we're starting. I've been stalling. Five seconds to start. We're starting with a side lunge with a leg lift. Okay, so one leg will stay straight. You're going down into the lunge, tap the ground, push up, switch your, switch your weight to this leg, and then lift your leg. Down and lift. Control it on the way down and lift. Try not to just drop back down into the lunge. Control it up and control it down. You can tap the ground to make sure you're going back far enough. Make sure the weight is in your heel and your knee is not going over your toe. So sideways, you're gonna go way down, okay? Now I switch sides, okay? So going down, leg lift, down. Okay, it's been less than a minute and my glutes are screaming already. <laughs> That's awesome. So, okay. Ugh. Try not to use this leg to get up. Sinking it down. As you're coming really low, kick it up. All right. Here we go. Back to the first side. Kick it up. Kick it up. You want to be coming as low as you can in that lunge. Ooh, 30 seconds doesn't seem like a long time unless you're murdering your glutes. 30 seconds is a long time to murder your glutes. If I am not ridiculously sore tomorrow, I will be surprised. <sighs> Screaming. <sighs> okay. Other side. Take it down and lift. Down. Lift. Nice and low. Touching the ground is good because then you know that you're getting low enough. And if you're touching your ground, the ground, and your chest is still showing and your face is still showing, that means you're not bending from the waist like this and you're actually doing the lunge. Down, which is what we want. Okay, other side. straight. Oh my gosh. Down. Kick it up. Down. Kick don't have my timer where I can see it. Ah, how many more? Oh my gosh, one more. Yeah. Down. Somebody's going to ask about my timer. I'm not using my gym boss, but you certainly could um, set it for 30-30. I'm just using a iPhone app timer. 
it was a free interval timer app. You just search interval timer. Oh. Or you can do it with me. Did you hear it? Activity completed. Yay. Okay, so that's four minutes down. Only 16 to go. We do math. Okay. The next set, we're going crab toe touches and plank toe touches. I had several of my clients this morning do this four minute thing. I kind of used them as guinea pigs to see how it went. And uh, it's a struggle to really keep your form in plank. So let's make sure that we fight for that form, okay? So we're flipping back and forth, crab toe touches, plank toe touches. And that's gonna start in five seconds. We get down the crab toe touches. You wanna make sure your bridge is as high as possible. I forgot to say, for this whole workout, you don't need any equipment at all. this. I'm actually in plank for the next four minute set, which is frightening. <laughs> so that'll be fun. jump in this little fountain in a second. <sighs> Boiling. Done. Yeah, yes. Okay. 
the next, I'm gonna stretch my shoulders for a second. The next exercise set is plank with a fly and a knee tap, which is really all too similar to what we just did, so it's gonna be a little painful for me. I'm gonna push through, I'm taking a sip of water. Somebody's gonna ask me what's in here. These are, instead of ice cubes, I put frozen organic cherries in here for a little bit of flavor. I learned that from my um, awesome husband. He actually put mandarin oranges or um, those little, little cutie oranges in his drink. Makes it a little flavorful. Okay, enough stalling talking about sexy husband. And we're going to go to planks with a fly and a new tap. And you're simply switching arms for four minutes. That's four minutes of plank, folks. Okay, here we go. Start me in five seconds. All right. Oh my goodness. All right. I'm gonna fly it up. Ooh. Tap the knee. Fly it up. Tap the knee. Tap the knee. Tap. 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 Sides. My shoulders are loving me right now. If you were feeling really if you're feeling like doing a more advanced move, you could certainly have a weight or one of those weighted balls in your hand. So you fly up the weight and then bring the weight down and tap. Or just bring your elbow and tap. 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 It is super humid here, so I am just dripping with sweat. Okay, we've got the cute next door neighbor on his trampoline if you're wondering what that noise is. Sweat is profuse. Okay. <sighs> Just so we're clear, that is not my child you hear. <sighs> Neighbor child winding. Okay, this 
sweat is just dripping off my face right now. It's crazy. Okay, we are three sets in, two sets to go. Oh, the next one's gonna be fun. Oh, because you get to hear the trampoline next door. Well, I do dynamic squats and push-ups back and forth. Now, push-ups, I always say to my clients, when I ask them to do a push-up, I tell them to do the push-up to their level. So if you're on your knees for your push-ups, and you can get all the way down, that's better than getting kind of have a halfway push-up on your toes. So I'm going to attempt maybe one or two on my toes, and then drop to my knees for the rest of the set, okay? So again, 30 seconds, 30 seconds for four minutes, back and forth dynamic squats and push-ups. I feel like I have a death wish today. Okay. All right, dynamic squats. Here we go. Feet together. Jump them out, sink it down and tap. Chest is high, chin high, so you're not bending like this. Sinking it way down. Boop. When this is done, I'm gonna try to come close to the camera so you can see how crazy hot it is here. It's so sweaty. Push-ups. Let's see what I've got. I haven't done a push-up in, I don't know, two weeks. <laughs> Here we go. humid. I think this is the last set. Yes, yes. Last set of these. So I have 30 seconds of each of these and then one more four minute set to make our 20 minutes. Okay, let's see if I can get at least three Top push ups in here. Last set. Oh, <laughs> exactly three. <laughs> Where is 
16 minutes in. Four minutes to go. The last one are bridge kicks and heel toe hip death. What is that? Okay, because we're doing four minutes, we're gonna go the heel toe hip death. We're gonna go on the right first, then the second time through left, third time right, fourth time left. Okay, so, and bridge kicks are the same all the way through. All right, you guys ready? Let me go sip. Oh. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, are you ready? You're ready. All right, down in the bridge, and here we go. Get the bridge as high as possible. leg is straight. Your top leg, you're going to go heel in the front, tap, lift it up high, toe in the back. Heel in the front, toe in the back. And right now you're going, oh, isn't that such a cute little exercise? Ha <laughs> ha. Hip, glute, death. But you're working all the rotator muscles in your hips. Oh my gosh. So I did my right leg up. So I'll do left leg next time. straight you can have a little micro bend these coupled with the first exercise and I'm going to be so sore hips are fire tomorrow Beautiful words. 
My phone has such a gorgeous voice. Okay, so, coming in close. Do you see the sweat? It's crazy. Okay, so that was the first day of our 10 days of full body workouts. Um, so, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, bye.